Iraq, Wikipedia article audio. Iraq or Iraq is a Levantine alcoholic spirit in the Ani's drinks family. It is a clear, colorless, unsweetened anise-flavored distilled alcoholic drink. The Persian version of Iraq does not contain anise, as it is usually produced from raisins, dates, or sugarcane. Iraq is the traditional alcoholic beverage in the Middle East, especially in the Levant, as well in Iran and Turkey. The word Iraq comes from Arabic, Iraq, meaning perspiration. Etymology Consumption Its pronunciation varies depending on local varieties of Arabic comma. Iraq is not to be confused with the similarly named liquor, Arak. Another similar sounding word is Arak, which in Armenia, Iran, Azerbaijan, and Georgia is the colloquial name of vodka, and not an aniseed flavored drink. Raki, Mastika, and Uzo are aniseed flavored alcoholic drinks, related to Iraq, popular in Turkey, Macedonia. Bulgaria, Cyprus, and Greece respectively. Iraq is usually mixed in proportions of approximately one-third Iraq and two-thirds water in a traditional eastern Mediterranean water vessel called a barik, Arabica barik, then the mixture is poured into small, ice-filled cups. This dilution causes the clear liquor to turn a translucent milky white color, this is because anethole. The essential oil of anise, is soluble in alcohol but not in water. This results in an emulsion, whose fine droplets scatter the light and turn the liquid translucent, a phenomenon known as luching. Iraq is commonly served with metza, which may include dozens of small traditional dishes. In general, Iraq drinkers prefer to consume it this way, rather than alone. It is also consumed with barbecues, along with garlic sauce. If ice is added after pouring it into the cup, this results in the formation of an aesthetically unpleasant layer on the surface of the drink, because the ice causes the oils to solidify. If water is added first, the ethanol causes the fat to emulsify, leading to the characteristic milky color. To avoid the precipitation of the anise, drinkers prefer not to reuse an Iraq filled glass. In restaurants, when a bottle of Iraq is ordered, the waiter will usually bring a number of glasses along with it for this reason. Distillation begins with the vineyards, and quality grape vines are the key to making good Iraq. The vines should be very mature and usually of a golden color. Instead of being irrigated, the vineyards are left to the care of the Mediterranean climate and make use of the natural rain and sun. The grapes, which are harvested in late September and October, are crushed and put in barrels together with the juice and left to ferment for three weeks. Occasionally the whole mix is stirred to release the CO2. Numerous stills exist including stainless steel or copper, pot, and column stills that will affect the final taste and specificity of the Iraq. The authentic copper stills with a Moorish shape are the most sought after. Preparation The finished product is made during the second distillation. The alcohol collected in the first distillation is distilled again but this time it is mixed with aniseed. The ratio of alcohol to aniseed may vary and it is one of the major factors in the quality of the final product. Another distillation takes place, usually on the lowest possible temperature. For a quality Iraq, the finished spirit is aged in clay amphoras to allow the angel's share to evaporate and thus the remaining liquid is the most suitable for consumption. Some brands Special edition of Iraq Al Hayat from Homs, Syria. Iraq Al Ryan from As Suwaita, Syria. Palestinian Iraq. 
Iraq Kawar of Nazareth, Israel Iraq al-Samar Beirut, Lebanon Sources and external links Lebanese, Israeli Iraq al-Namraud